Hey everybody, it's Shelby with a Chick Plus 3. Welcome. I hope everybody is doing well today. All is fine in my neck of the woods. Um, it's just a dreary day outside, so I'm sorry if the lighting is kind of crummy. I'm trying to do my best to get it bright enough and not drive you all insane with a reflection off my glasses. <laughs> but what I have for you today is a Michael's haul, so not a Dollar Tree haul, a little something different from me, but um, it is a Michael's haul. And then I have a couple items that I got um, from an online Marshall's order that I will add on at the end. So if that sounds like something that interests you, I'd love to have you join me. What do you say? We'll jump right in. Let's go. So I found some really cute things at Michael's. It was just a spur of the moment trip. We were in the area. The parking lot was like deserted. So I decided to run in and I was happy I did because they had their spring and Easter things on sale. Pretty much everything was 40% off. I had looked around at the Valentine's Day items, but those were only 50% off and there was nothing you know, that I wanted to store away for a year. But I was very happy with my finds. Now the first thing that I was looking for is not holiday related, but it is this storage tub. And this was um, regularly $14.99, so I got it for $7.50. Now I already have one of these. I do a lot of um, paper crafting, and so this works perfect with all the compartments for your stickers, your double-sided tape, um, all various things like that. So I got this to put all my crafting tools, like my glue gun, a pair of scissors, wire cutters, things that I use regardless of um, what project that I may be working on so that I have kind of one handy tote in place and then when the day comes that we can, you know, move around and go to other people's homes again, I would have this to just kind of grab and grow, uh, grab and go if I was going someplace to do a craft. So the next item I picked up are these adorable little bunny salt and pepper shakers. I thought these were so sweet. Now the original price of these were $7.99. I was able to get them at 40% off. Now I have seen people haul little bunny Easter salt and pepper shakers from the Target dollar spot for $3.00. But um, I'm not able to go in our Target right now. It's always far too busy. Um, I haven't been inside of it in a year. And the dollar spot items are not available, sadly, um, online or curbside pickup in our area anyways. But I thought these were really sweet with the little uh, pastel flowers on them, the little inner pink ear. So I was happy to grab those. The next item I picked up, now these are called toppers. They were regularly $1.99, so these ended up being $1.19, so I thought that was nice, you know, pretty comparable to the Dollar Tree. And they say, Happy Easter, Happy Spring. You know, they're like little cupcake picks, but I, um, maybe I'll use some on some cupcakes, but I plan on using these in crafting sweet little signs, so I was glad I found those. And so along those lines, I grabbed for St. Patrick's Day these toppers. Now these were just a dollar because their St. Patrick's Day items were 50% off and these originally were $1.99. So I have coming up, I believe it will go live this Sunday, a St. Patrick's Day um, uh, Sunday crafting corner with me and I'm going to be doing a St. Patrick's Day item. So I thought that this could work in this. I'd like to give myself options in my crafting. So again, for a dollar, I thought those were absolutely adorable. You get 12 of them. So I picked those up. And then the last uh, topper I picked up, uh, $1.99, but again, 40% off. And it's these little Easter bunnies. You get 12 in this package also. 
they have a little bit of sparkle, a little bit of glitter on them. You know, the little purple headband, the flowers, the carrot. So I thought those were sweet. Again, will be coming in very handy for crafting. The next item I picked up is this spatula. Now the regular price of this is $4.99, so that is pretty pricey. But I was actually able to get um, this for 50% off. And they had some others that I was tempted that had rabbits, um, you know, very Easter specific. So I liked the fact that I thought this I could just use for spring and summer with those colors. Um, my husband had got me one of the Michael's spatulas for my birthday um, in September and it was a, a Halloween, a black cat, and I really liked the quality. I used it a lot. It washed up well. And this is something that I don't have in my collection, our like holiday themed um, kitchen tools. So I thought I'd treat myself and I grabbed that. I kind of, you know, as I say, I never get to go into Michael's. This was a spur of the moment trip, so I had to kind of make my decisions quickly and get things because I figured, you know, I will probably not get another opportunity before Easter. So the next item I picked up is this cute little bunny. Now I have a collection of hands on nest that I love like in the milk glass so this little guy is just plastic he was originally $4.99 they had him in this like nice turquoisey bluish green and pink um, so I went with this color so just a little rabbit on the nest and I thought this one will be cute to keep on the kitchen table with jelly beans so you know things that I won't have um, any concerns over my grandkids you know lifting the lid and taking the candy out where um, right now the three-year-old you know I really wouldn't want him handling the milk glass ones because first of all I'd be sad if he dropped it and it broke and he'd be sad and I also don't want him to be cut so I thought this little guy is really sweet so I picked him up and they had a bunch of interesting chargers. Now, I think that Michaels maybe had this one out last year. But I just like how the Easter Bunny is just kind of peeking over the top. And um, I don't recall previously seeing for spring or Easter really any picture chargers at the Dollar Tree. My Dollar Tree anyways, regardless of the time of year, pretty much has like the silver, the gold, um, the red. So, uh, you know, they. I wish this is something that they would come out with as more themed chargers. If your Dollar Trees have them, I'd be very curious to know. But so far, I've never seen, um, you know, a charger with any embellishment, any picture. And I just really liked the colors of this. This matches my um, everyday dishes, my Luray collection that I have. Um, the colors are very similar, so I thought that this would go nice with those. So I was happy to grab this. And the original price of this was $2.99. So what, I probably paid like $1.75, I think, for that. You know, so I would have rather got it at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. So hopefully they'll come out with items like that. And then um, the next item I picked up is this ceramic berry basket. So my store had them. I almost said Dollar Tree. <laughs> I wish uh, Michaels had this in red and then this um it's it's a shade of green and so in the summer i am um decorating with like strawberries or at least part of the summer um maybe all summer but in any case so i i have some beautiful i think real realistic looking artificial strawberries and i wanted something you know more realistic looking um, reminiscent of a berry basket to put them in and I was considering oh just going to the farmers market you know buying real strawberries and 
bringing home because they still have those nice like thick papery berry baskets and using a real basket which I still may do um, because now the berries that we buy in our grocery store in any case come in um, like just clear plastic containers they're not like in the old-fashioned paper berry baskets anymore but I picked this up. It was on sale for $5, regularly $9.99. So I figured I would get that because, you know, I, I haven't seen anything like this before. And again, I wanted to make sure I had it. They only had um, one in this color and two red on the shelf. That was it. So I figured while they had it, I would pick it up. And then the last two items that I picked up at Michael's, and it's two of the same thing. You get five in a package, and it is this little wooden whale cutout. So that's right on par with the Dollar Tree. I mean, you know, now a lot of the wood cutouts at the Dollar Tree, they're giving you more than five. But I liked the primitive shape of the whale, and um, I have some artwork by my mother and just um, in any case this primitive style and with the whale I grew up um, on the Cape, Cape Cod that is, in Massachusetts and so I just like to also decorate in the summertime with um, things that fit the Cape Cod theme. Even though I'm in upstate New York I have um, Falmouth in my heart. So I thought these little whales were sweet. I don't recall ever seeing whales at the Dollar Tree. So I grabbed myself two packages of those. So that is everything I have from Michael's. I do have so I do have two items that I purchased online from Marshall's. So what I'll do is pause the camera and grab those because certainly two items it does not warrant its own haul, but um, it's all Easter related. So I will show those to you right now also. Okay, so the two items that I got at Marshall's online are these adorable rabbits by Martha Stewart. They were $6.99 each. Look at her beautiful little expression. The long eyelashes. These are about 12 inches tall. She has a nice rosy peach colored egg. So I got her. And then the second one Another adorable little expression with a minty green egg. So there's the tag, Marshalls, again, Martha Stewart. The finish on these is really nice. My husband and I have a Yardro collection that we inherited from his mother, and so these um, fit in very nice with that. They have just that same um, look to them with a very smooth finish, nice, like clean, but curved lines, just simple. So I was really pleased to find these. And I mean, I personally think $6.99 is a great price for these. Um, I'm sorry the lighting is making it hard because the faces are, are quite pale but little cute nose and mouth, the eyes, and just the very, very slightest, slightest, slightest touch of pink in her cheeks and in the ears. So I thought those were cute, and I was really pleased to get those. And um, so these were my two new bigger pieces of Easter decor this year. So um, now I think I will be all set adding these to what I already have from years and years and years gone by. <laughs> so thanks everybody for sticking around. I hope you enjoyed that. I myself am very excited to decorate for spring. It's a little early yet for me to start, even though I am very tempted, but I am going to hold off for a bit. Um, but as always, I want to thank you all for taking some time out of your very busy days to spend a little bit of it with me. And until next time, everybody, please be well.